The main smartness impact for our network is the design and coordination of a sustainable collaboration, but also the support along the collaborative development and production process, as well as the over-application of this new industrial model, will have an important impact on the involved enterprises. The network is composed by three SMEs with specific roles. Grado Zero Spask with the role of coordinator and technical supporter, Turcon, a chemistry lab with the role of material developer, and Trionic with the responsibility for the final product development and manufacturing. Each of us has its own business model, supported by an ecosystem of actors such as suppliers, customers, and services providers. Within SmartNet's project, several actors are interconnected into a galaxy of potential collaboration opportunities, and each of them bring valuable information into the project to enable the development of a knowledge-intensive products and services. Based on this new approach, the three companies start to explore the helmet work by developing a novel technological advanced material. The Matex material shows extraordinary characteristics, able to develop a product with significant progress behind the state of art of current EPS standard shock absorbing material for inner shell. In order to support collaborative innovations, we need to define a process that describes the way from the idea to the final product. The resulting SmartNet Navigator combines a reference process with a toolbox containing methods to support creativity, problem solving and analysis. The system supports you with decisions on which activity should be taken next and assists you in performing the respective tasks. After identified customer requirements, we started to evaluate the fact to use Matex technology into a new concept of head protection. The aim is to have a thinner and smaller helmet, even lighter and cheaper, because a different production process is now possible. In the meanwhile, the development of Matex was going on and its extraordinary multi-impact properties were confirmed by specific international motorcycle regulations. Various set of tests have been performed, but a deep evaluation of the material were needed. But how to do it? During the next phase, SmartNet Navigator suggested to involve new external providers especially when it comes to critical issues, you might need specific technical support. For instance, we discovered an anomalous material behavior when performed mechanical tests in wet conditions. In order to find out its causes and possible solutions, a cooperation between internal people and external providers was done and the problem was solved successfully using a fully coding technique. Coming back to the product development, a prototyping activity was needed to take decisions on the final design, combining qualities of inner shell and outer shell. The final product has been engineered and optimized at industrial scale. To be ready for the production, after elaborating a marketing plan, we needed to perform a plan for the production and life cycle handling. Thanks to a virtual simulation, the first pilot scale production was planned with manufacturing capabilities up to 200 units per day. The process model for collaborative development and production is now ready to be exploited, and the novel smartness product with a multi-sectorial potential is coming soon. So we will bring smartness model in our internal uh, network. So several tools have been analyzed 
and some of them are very effective. My favorite one is the navigator, which um, is a visual guide which gives us uh, information about the status of the project. So based on this information, it is possible to be aware also of the weakness and the resource needed in a certain point. Following the success of the development of the material in the helmet application, we think we can achieve the production of innovative helmets. In addition to this, the project has given us the opportunity to investigate other applications of Matex, our material. Smartnet taught us that to use innovative tools of communication, sharing and storage, storage information flows. These are tools that we continue to use in our future as we believe that they are very helpful and useful for our daily work. I intend to proceed further with the, with the use and uh, with the application of all methodologies and tools Smart had provided me. As first, Trisha as a knowledge platform that we found very useful and powerful, and also all the other tools they provided us.